Good morning. Baby. Hi, mommy. <laughs> we aren't really doing anything today. I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby, but we're just waiting to go to school. In like 10 minutes, we'll leave. Yeah. Just got done eating breakfast. Yeah, I had I had um, Lucky Charms and Bobby had Fruit Loops. He's yeah. still eating them. We had also. cereal today because mommy got up late, so I didn't have time to make breakfast. <sighs> we woke up at 7.12. Normally I get up at 6.30. But yeah. So, I haven't even, like, I haven't even brushed my teeth yet. That's how early in the morning it still is. So we're just gonna hang out today. Um, I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby and then I'm gonna go to Party City, I think. And get some, like, decor and stuff for somebody's birthday party coming up. Me. <laughs> Need to go um, like get balloons and streamers and like tablecloth and stuff like that. I'm gonna be turning eight years old and I'm having a unicorn party. Cause we love unicorns. Yeah. So yeah. Just For my next birthday, I'm having morning. a Jojo Siwa one. Mm, a Jojo Siwa birthday. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Anyways. Jojo Siwa. I have a couple of videos to film this week, but I figured I'd do a vlog because I haven't vlogged in a while. But yeah, and I'll take you guys along with me into Hobby Lobby I'm and Party City. I'm too. We can... Anyways, I figured I'd take you guys with me into Hobby Lobby and Party City. Um, just to see kind of what's going on there. See if they have any cute spring decor and stuff like that. So, yeah. So we'll check back in later after I take this little one to school. Hi. A little bit of editing magic. Here I am. One second later with makeup done. Hi. Um, let me get let me get to my lighting. Hi. It is now what time is it? It's ten eighteen. Um, obviously I did my makeup. I don't think we're actually going to go to Hobby Lobby today, just because I have a lot of stuff to do today, like cleaning and hi, hi Bubby. Um. Uh. What else was I gonna do? Oh, I was gonna clean. I might go to Walmart today, but I doubt it. And my daughter has dance today at um, like 4:15. So, and then and my son naps from 12 to like 3. So it's really hard to it's really hard to leave my house, honestly. <sighs> I really am trying to find what baby. Mark, Mark, how Joker? You can have the Joker. Go get the remote. Okay. Okay. I'm really looking for some more spring decor. I have just been dying to try and find these um. Little wood, like little wood, just decor eggs from Target. They're in the Target dollar spot, but my Target, what? or at least the two Targets around me, do not have them. They only have the plain wood colored ones, and I really don't feel like painting them. So, I'm trying to find you uh, spring decor. I'm sure we'll find something. I might text my friend and see if she's left yet for where Lawrence. Otherwise, I could go with her to Hobby Lobby. And I want Joker. Ugh. Joker. I'm gonna watch Joker. Okay. He loves the song. It's called. Oh, Joker. I think it's by Hollywood oh, on YouTube. Joker. I don't really know what Dad, that is, Joker. but let me text her and see if she's left yet. I was hoping I would get to take you guys to Hobby Lobby, but there's just never enough time in the day. No. So speak of the devil, right? Speak of cute spring decor. So I just got happy mail. <clears throat> Excuse me, I just got happy mail from um, Boxed Home Decor. And if you guys watched my, not my last video, but the video before of um, my spring home decor tour, I spoke about Boxed Home Decor in my daughter's room. They sent me that really, really pretty, like, um, brown paper scroll for my daughter's room. Uh, it was so pretty. And they reached out to me again and asked if I would showcase their, um, May subscription box. So Box Home Decor is a company and they have a ton of farmhouse decor. And the best thing is, is that they have a farmhouse decor subscription box. And they sent me some goodies and I will give you all the deets here in a minute. But I wanna show you um, everything that's in the box because it's really cute. Uh, I will say that the first thing I noticed when I opened the box, well, it's not the first thing. I mean, obviously I saw the stuff first. But I did notice that they don't give you like a, um, What's that called? Like a 
description card they don't really um, there's no card letting you know where the product is from how much the product is um, worth and stuff like that so I would like to personally um, see where each product is from that way if it's something that I really really love I can go to that company myself and look at more of their products but because I'm, I'm on Instagram I can kind of tell where a lot of this stuff is from or not a lot but I can I can tell so the first thing I got in the Maybox is this very pretty spring pillow cover and it is an 18 by 18 pillow cover, so it'll fit um, the Ikea inserts, which I feel like most people use now. And it has the pretty, uh, like, Robin's Blue Egg bike with a little basket of flowers. And it is zip closure on the bottom. Um, and it is not white. It's kind of a off-white color. If I can get in here. And it's textured, if you can see that. Um, it is a very pretty and very well-made pillow cover. I do believe this is from the company Southern Jarring Company, which they are on Instagram. I'll link them down below, or I'll put a little um, little little blip right here with their name on it. But a very cute pillow cover. I already have a couple of their pillow. Pil I already have a couple of their pillow covers um, that they sent to me personally. So yes, definitely a very cute little spring thing. And then I got this beautiful um, bouquet of lavender. And I mean, it's fake, so it doesn't obviously smell like lavender, but I thought I'd give it a shot. Um, it's very realistic looking. And it's just wound together with some rubber bands and a little bit of twine or hay twine stuff. Very realistic and very pretty. Um, definitely perfect for spring for like a little vase or something. And then the next thing they sent was, this is actually from Creative Co-op. And if you've never heard of them, and the reason I know that is because there's a sticker on the bottom. Are you going to focus? If I hide my face, maybe it'll focus. There you go, Creative Co-op. Um, they actually make, hello, uh, they actually make those really popular enamel bread boxes that you see everywhere. I actually have one. Let me bring it up. So this, oh, it's loud. So this bread box that everyone has um, is by Creative Co-op. Anyways, it is by Creative Co-op, and so they make a lot of really quality products. And so this adorable little thing, you can't probably tell what it is at the moment, but it is actually like a little beehive glass thing. And the top comes off and it has a little bumblebee on the top. If I can cover my face. Here, we'll do this. It has a little B right there on the top. And the top does come off, so it comes with a little, um, what is this called? I don't actually know what it's called, like a honeycomb thingy. It's the thing that you use for honey, like old school honey. And it has a little divot in the lid, so you can put that in there. Like, look how adorable that is. Um, I'm not actually going to put honey in it. I'm going to put, like decor in it or maybe just leave it plain and put it up on my bookshelf that has all my um like knickknacks and stuff on it but yes I love this this is so cute <clears throat> and then my favorite thing that they sent which is a really like big heavy piece is and I don't know where it's from like I said I wish they gave you a um little description card um but I'm very excited about this piece <gasps> look at this birdhouse <clears throat> look it's huge for one and it has like the distressed chippy wood and then the barn tin like roof. It's made out of real wood as far as I can tell. Um, very large, like it's bigger than my head. And it doesn't say, it doesn't say where it's from so you guys can't buy this individually. But how cute is this? Okay, so Boxed Home Decor is a company. They are based in Utah and they... Um, they do have a monthly subscription box like I just showed you and it's $59.95 a month and every month you're going to get um, like four to five items of just farmhouse decor based on the season. They have other farmhouse decor that um, you can buy separately outside of the subscription box so they have like de deconstructed books, the scroll that I showed you guys in my um, spring decor tour, 
and stuff like that. They have a little tea towel ladder. How cute. Um, they really do have just a ton of stuff and I really recommend going to see them. So I guess I didn't have to go to Hobby Lobby today because I just got some new spring decor. So yay. Um, that This part of the video is sponsored by Boxed Home Decor. And they did send me this the, this box uh, for me to showcase. And I'm so glad I did. I'm so excited. It's such a cute freaking box. I love it. Okay. Little Miss is home from school. We're getting ready for dance. Why are you so angry looking? I just finished... Oh, sorry my glare, glare. I just finished editing, finished editing my video. Stop, boo-boo. I just finished editing, editing my spring cleaning favorites video. Um, we're getting ready to go to dance here in a minute. I gotta drop Atticus off at, there we go, there's some light. I gotta drop Atticus off at my mother's. She's gonna go to dance. We get Bubby. What are you doing? Bubby, can I hold it? Up? That is very loud. Can I hold it? Nope, you cannot. She's going to get her costumes today for her big showcase recital. <laughs> Quit being a freak. So we're we're excited to see her uh, dance recital costumes. They cost enough money. Good lord. Um. But yeah. <laughs> Are anyone else's kids this loud? Or is it this mine? Bubby! <laughs> Alright, dance is over. I went to Price Chopper and got the like fried chicken meal. It comes with like eight pieces of chicken. Saw a couple sides, like some gravy and biscuits or whatever. Just because Tuesdays it's really hard for me to like actually cook a meal because. I don't get home until 6.30 normally, 6.45, because I do a price shopper. But, we got all of Natalie's costumes for her recital, and everything Yay. fits well. I'm bleeding. You're bleeding, what? Where? Why are you bleeding on your elbow? That scratch again, and the scab came off Oh, I'm sorry, boo-boo. We'll go clean it and put a Band-Aid on it when we go home. But yeah, so now we're on our way home. I'm just down the street from my house. Gonna have you know some what? dinner, I'm gonna put the kids to bed. Did you check the mail today, Beeps? Yeah. Okay. I got with you. Can I drive with you? Can I drive with you? Mommy. All right, let's go inside. They're taking a bubble bath. I can't wait to take my bubble bath but later. Um, my butt. Yeah, you putting your butt in the bath? Burda, burda, burda. But man, I was thinking about Natalie's costumes for dance and stuff and how expensive it is. It was $120 for three costumes, which I guess isn't bad. It's like what, 40 bucks a costume? But dance is expensive. It's just, oh man. It's just way more expensive than we anticipated. But it's worth it because Natalie loves it. Still. I have to clean the house. It's filthy. I didn't do hardly any picking up today because I look. filmed and edited, so. They could look under the sofa. No, Natalie, nobody's gonna look. I'm not turning the camera. Yay! I can't wait to take a bath with look, this everybody. stuff later. My Dr. Teal's does. But I'm gonna go ahead and wash them up. Wash my boobies. And then I'll check back in when I'm ready. Mom has socks on. <sighs> yeah. You don't have socks on. Yeah, I do. My goodness. Yeah. Okay. Be back. I better wash that boy's hair. Kids are in bed. <sighs> Finally. It's been such a long day, it seems like, even though you guys have only seen like, I don't know, like 15 minutes of it. This day seems like it's never ending. Um, so I'm going to edit this vlog and I'm going to work in my planner. <sighs> and then probably watch a bit of telly. So. Yeah, I'm just exhausted, sorry. I wasn't looking at the camera, so I didn't know where I was pointing it. And sorry about the glare in here. I need to wash my face too, but I, <sighs> I'm so full from dinner. That fried chicken is so good. Um, but I'm gonna end the vlog here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do and you would like to see more vlogs, uh, give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Um, 
and that's it i make one to two videos a week on family lifestyle diy and home decor thanks guys